Hello YouTube. Uh, today I decided to do a really quick review of this, um, what is supposed to be a shaker. This is one of those that you can see in the Ford Direct. This brand is Lonsdale, but it's only the Ford Direct that sells them. Sells them. Um, this has been bought a long time ago. They always say it's a four pound value, but they never changed the price. That's, that's supposed to be a really nice shaker with the additional part to it. One for the hairs, like uh, tabs and stuff, and one for the powder, which is supposed to be attached like that. And everything looks fine when you buy it, until the very moment when you decide to check the lid. This is a as you see one of the very important parts of it and this is the cap. Normally the cap would be something that would hold liquid inside your sport bag to avoid the spillages and everything being ruined inside the bag. But in this case if you listen to it there's no clip to it. Well there is but it's not what you would expect the power of it holding it there it's really miserable if you look at the pen how i'm holding it sorry that's nothing that's absolutely nothing this is just for the purpose of demonstration how easy it is to open it the reason for this is because as i figured out this is a copy of original shaker this is a fake they selling a fake this is like chinese used to copy stuff good stuff so now uh, lonsdale is doing the same and how i figured out is because i bought another item which is not bought from sports direct this is exactly the same thing well almost exactly the same thing apart from the fact that this one is original and the difference between these two is when you look inside here I don't know if it's possible to see uh, there is no grooves nothing inside it's just plain thing same thing in here if you look at the edge which is straight and it's obvious that plastic straight straight on straight plastic will never hold it there simple as that you know when you look at this one it's exactly the same thing absolutely all the all the lines are the same all the uh, basically everything is exactly matching but look at this one have you heard the difference in the clip trust me it is it is I mean this is not the best clip I've ever seen but comparing to this one is like day and night if you look inside here i'm not sure if it's possible to see but there is a little groove in here there is a little groove in here and when you look at the at the edges probably not very obvious here on the video but the top of this neck is kind of spread it a little bit so it gives a nice uh, step for the cap to clip on you can hear that there's no way for me to open this with a pen there's no way see but it's a different story right the pen is like absolutely not in the same position in my hand and the reason why I'm saying it's fake is because if you look at the edges here, see this thing and this thing, it looks very obvious to me. Uh, it's probably not very obvious at all on the video, but this was simply copied from that one. Just copied and molded again. Because this one it has all the edges, all the little lines visible and sharp. And this one is just, I don't know like really really cheap Chinese fake even if you look at this side you 
you can see they've been just somehow quickly copying it. So, and yeah, as I said, this is not the best clip I've ever seen in my life, but this is probably the worst I've ever seen in my life. And we can compare it to my old shakers. This is my old shaker, this is the oldest one. I'm not going to tell you how many years I have, I have this one, but it's like loads of years. And this is one of the worst that I've known before this. The worst, worst cap, I mean. And still it has double edge inside. And still it has nice uh, step for it to clip on. And we, even with this one, with this one, I used to have cases where my water would spill inside my bag. So this is not the best, but it's like really, really cheap and generic, so it does the job. And this much, much safe. This one is much safer than that one. Like much safer. Trust me, I've tried that. And this is again one of the old, really old, generic uh, shakers. You can buy them really cheap nowadays. And if you look at the difference, see this? And what it does, it plugs the neck and the edge around it, just holds it together. This is really, really safe. It's really difficult to open it. It doesn't look like, but trust me, it is. So there's a little groove ins inside there. And the plug, it has like a little expansion on the end. So when you clip it there, clicks right and to check that it's easy by doing so you just remove the clip and you attach it without it and you see how safe it is right you can take it off obviously but it's still much safer so you do it with this crap ah, this is the hard of fucking question doesn't doesn't even try to hold it. Doesn't even try to hold it. I, I can't release it because it would go. This is absolutely unacceptable by Sports Direct. So this kind of crap. Shame on you, Sports Direct. Absolutely shame on you. And look at this. Yeah, this is actually like the same as absolutely disgusting quality. Cheap, cheap copy. Don't ever, ever, ever in your life buy this stuff. This is the worst shaker officially. Away, you've been warned. Thank you very much. Take care.